my name is Maria Juzwiak. I live in southern Poland, which is a really beautiful place. There are a lot of green hills and valleys, so it's en encouraged to um, social and sport activity. I'm a student, I'm student of the second class in Fiercely Sam in Tarnów, the best school in my area. And um, I chose uh, this one because I wanted to extend my mind and it was the right decision. Um, during class two years of my education in this uh, school, I taking part in, for example, uh, uh, Olympiad of Philosophy. And I was in final of uh, uh, logic contest organized by Lublin University. Apart from that, I, I took part in uh, Olympiad of uh, Literature and Polish Language, and I have a uh, good results. And I'm going to um, I'm going to uh, try again the next year, and I believe in success. <laughs> but I'm not only interested in humanistic areas; I'm also interesting in science, especially in physics. I would like to, um, in the future, I would like to um, study something connect with it. And I'm, so I'm uh, do my best uh, to achieve it. For example, I'm, um, I'm taking part in every um, science events and projects, which I'm able to, and I'm attend to, uh, physics and maths club after my uh, lessons uh, in my school. And I'm preparing my, myself to, uh, to take part in uh, physics uh, Olympiad in the next year. I believe that it will be a great experience. Um, <laughs> sorry, I don't know if you hear my sibling, but uh, I, I hope that no it's worries. Not, it's no worries. Okay. We can okay. hear it's lovely. It's lovely. It's Don't lovely. worry. It's okay. okay. No worries. Okay. And um, I'm taking part in uh, um, various contexts in physics, and I always uh, have a good result. So I believe that uh, this time it also be great uh, um, success and a great experience. In the future, I would like to become a nuclear physician, visit nuclear physicist, and um, I would like to work scientifically on the new technologies and, uh, for example, cold, cold fusion and uh, on nuclear projects. So I'm uh, achieve. Uh, so I would like to follow my dreams. So I'm. Uh, take, I'm here and I'm taking the chance to uh, to see the mm, national laboratory uh, national accelerator laboratory in Stanford University. I think it will be a great uh, experience and um, it's amazing chance for me. Um, I think that this uh, scholarship uh, could give me a lot of education, a lot of um, motivation and inspired me to put a lot of effort and heart into my works. And I believe that it will be a chance to meet some smart people with bright ideas and it uh, allow me to broaden my horizons and uh, uh, <laughs> and um, find the and um, assure me that I'm heading the right direction. Thank you for your attention. Thank you. Thank you, Marisha. Thank you. Uh, so we will start the session with the question now, and I will ask okay. Tomasz as the first pe person to ask questions. Yes, um, uh, Maria, thank you very much for your presentation. Uh, in your essay, you, you talked a lot about uh, Szczepanik. Um, yes. and, and, and his skills. So please pick uh, two skills of his, which uh, totally describe you. And um, give me some example and then give me some examples uh, to, 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 to evidence that. 
Okay. It, so skills, it, skills of Stepanik which describes you, which, which okay. you follow. I think I'm open mind. I have open mind. I like I like Stepanik and I uh, can connect facts uh, for a few areas. So it's uh, uh, helped me to uh, broaden my horizons. And I think that is uh, important. Uh, the second thing is maybe my curiosity about the world. I'm really interested how uh, things surrounding me works and uh, the physics uh, principles that uh, which um, results uh, which um, uh, describe them. And uh, I'm easy learner. It's uh, not a big deal to me to work something new. And uh, Stepanik was a person who have um, lack of uh, formal education. So uh, he must um, do ev study everything on his own. And I think that I could do the same, maybe not as well as he, but I believe that I will can, I can. Okay. Thank you. Um, you, you. You mentioned that you want to be a, um, a scientist in physics. Uh, if not this um, space, what would it be? If not science and, and, and physics? I think that uh, something could still connect with uh, physics, but maybe more technical, like for exa example, automatics and robotics, or um, something with IT. I think that it will be a good uh, decision and we it uh, uh, um, <laughs> and it um, allow me to develop myself in these areas and um, and I think that is will I think do something like this. Okay, thank you very much. That's all for me. Hi, Marisha. What is your uh, real passion? Uh, I mean, because uh, you are good in, in Polish language, uh, in, in mathematics, uh, in uh, physics. Uh, what really turns you on? I think that physics, uh, I'm sure that it's physics because uh, it's, uh, for me, it's really curious. Uh, I'm really curious how the world works and how the things around us uh, works and uh, what, which, uh, what can get from it from the physics principles. And I think that uh, physics is my, <laughs> that's my main passion. And uh, I'm, I'm sure that is physics. Okay, thank you. And uh, if you had the chance to ask the, 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 the commission one question, what would it be? I would like to ask about uh, something with Stanford University, how uh, um, it will, uh, um, the program of this scholarship uh, look like. And uh, apart of that, I think that I ask about um, how, <laughs> what is uh, for you the most uh, important um, skills and for the most important, um, um, more, most important skills to you for for be success in the future. Okay, very clever question. Thank you very much. Yes, very nice questions. As a headhunter, I, I ask the question myself very very often. Uh, Marisha, um, I have I have that curiosity about you, and I would like to ask you what what's your hobby? I mean, I'm not uh, talking about the science and you know okay. education, but you know, what's your mm -hmm. hobby? What do you like to do? In I really like kayaking and uh, reading a books, as I say, but because I'm uh, taking part in. Um, Olympiad of uh, literature and Polish language, but I think that is kayaking and, and I really like uh, uh, going, um, walking in the mountains. And is these uh, two things I think is, uh, I'm, I really like, and uh, I don't know why, for example, kayaking, because it's, uh, not something special in it. It's uh, but I'm close to nature and I with my uh, friends and it's great. It's
uh, way of great. Uh, I have a great time uh, doing it. So it's it's it. And what is your favorite book? So uh, what book would you recommend me to read if I want to read something really interesting? Mm -hmm. Oh, I think it depends because I like um, popular, popular, popular scientist books, like for example, uh, the um, short story of the time, but I'm also reading, um, I don't know, uh, Crime and Punishment and is uh, I have a, uh, uh, a lot of uh, my favorite books, uh, but I think that uh, for you, maybe uh, interesting will be um, maybe something classic. I don't know, uh, because uh, every every person is uh, special and I don't know what you uh, like, but I think that's uh, I will. Me, I will very... check this short story of the time for sure. So thank oh. you for the recommendation. Uh, thank you. Thank you, Marisha. Now it's uh, time for the feedback for you. So Tomasz, if you can share the feedback with Marisha. Yes, uh, Marisha, I, I think one, one piece of advice would be uh, because th there, th there were a few moments when you caught yourself stuck um, and it's normal. It happens to all of mm -hmm. us. Um, when, when, we, when we have meetings, when we have presentations, uh, it happens to us all, all the time. I think that the key is to uh, not necessarily to, 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 to show it that you're stuck. Okay. <laughs> uh, in, in Polish, uh, I will quote Polish sentence. Uh, there's a this sentence, Dobra uh, mina do złej gry, right? Uh, and 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 this is exactly uh, I don't know uh, whether you know what where it is, this this is coming from. This is exactly coming from uh, the musicians uh, who play, and they let's say they make false note. Nobody knows yes. that, and if you don't show it, nobody knows that still. So even you're stuck, continue, follow your uh, uh, what what you wanted to say not necessarily really showing that you're stuck. Okay, thank Other you very that, much. I, I, I like your presentation very much. Uh, Marisha, you are a great person and I enjoyed your, the conversation with you very much. Once again, thank you for it. I uh, don't trust too much to yourself. Uh, don't trust too much to your skills. Uh, structure your presentation. I, you are great in Polish language, you are great in sciences but structure your, your presentation, uh, send us uh, three messages. Uh, normally people don't comprehend more uh, and that will be enough. Okay. I, I enjoyed the conversation with you very much. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Marisha, I enjoyed the conversation with you as well. You are, you know, the person with uh, different passions and uh, the, your story is about physics and about NASA. It's it's really inspiring, you know. But uh, what I will advise you, it's a little bit more self-confidence and practice in English because that <laughs> influence the way you present. So that would be the piece of my uh, advice from, from myself. Okay, thank you very much. Dziękujemy Marysiu um, ci bardzo za tą prezentację i wyniki uh, będą uh, jutro. Dziękuję ślicznie, do widzenia. Bardzo dziękuję, do widzenia. Do widzenia.